Thomas Bay from Hood News, News for News. We are in Park Lane Park. And right across the street on Morrison Court and Scranton, excessive force and brutality was used by Officer Moore of District 1 of Rural Police Department. We have many witnesses in the community that witnessed this act. Let me ask you a question. Do you have any violence in your background? I don't have a violent background at all. Okay, you know, because I'm trying to see why someone would come at somebody, you know, and on this kind of level when he's walking by himself and, and no one's been hurt. I believe that I was racially profiled. Okay, now we, we're going to show the audience a picture of this brother's face. If you're squeamish, please turn away. Was you just walking down the street or did you have an altercation with anybody? Well, just before that, I was in front of my own home and I had an altercation in front of my own house with someone. And there was no knife involved in Was it physical? It was not physical. Oh. The person who I got the altercation with is in fact still cooperative with me today. So y'all still friends and neighbors? Yes. I talked to the witness. She refuses to be on camera or give her name, so we're just going to refer to her as Miss B. Uh, Miss B states that she saw Tyson on the ground handcuffed, and the officer was on his neck and back. She said also Tyson looked like he was struggling a little bit. As I walk up, my son's telling me he's in pain. Call an ambulance. And another officer there heard him say, and said, oh, no, he'll be seen by the jail nurse. I go, well, first of all, what did my son do to deserve this? He's all bruised up on the side of his face. Well, uh, the one officer said, well, he tried to take my pistol, which was not true. And she heard someone yell, help me, help me. Somebody please help me. That's what prompted her to come outside. So when she came outside, she seen this gentleman on the ground. He so said he was chasing up. somebody down the street with a knife, which was not true because there was no witness, no victim, no knife. But they have my son in this hot police car and he's ready to pass out. I call an ambulance. Once this happened, a female officer said, yes, we need to move him out the sun. They took the cuffs off him, put him in the ambulance, and gave him a ticket for resisting arrest. Now, according to my calculations, I've been arrested before. If you're resisting arrest, once you're detained, you're going to jail. Mm. So why was he given a ticket for resisting arrest and obstruction of justice? There was no charge of carrying a concealed weapon. There was no charge of trying to disarm an officer of the law. This is Collins Bay with Hood News, news you can use. This situation that continues to go on within the community will stop because we do not need to fear the very people that's protecting us. So I'm giving, you know, uh, a cry out to all the gangsters and, you know, cats in the street that kill each other and that we kill each other. Um, I'm urging y'all to uh, channel your energies. Channel your energy. This is Hood News, news you can use, Collins Bay. Yeah. Hell yeah. Uh, my name is Tony Marshall. I'm a barber here at Cold Cut. Been here for about 14 years. visit us. Our address is 15179 East Colfax, Unit D, Aurora, Colorado. Phone number 303-341-0740. Uh, Come give us a holler. All right.
maximum development is on the case. So what's being done right now is the proper steps. And the proper steps that's for anyone has that, that, that's being abused, that's scared to even come forth about the officer in your district, in your neighborhood, um, understand that we pay taxes. Understand that we provide for the community also. So you can't be scared of someone who's supposed to serve and protect. News you can use, man. This is, I mean, this is what goes down in the hood. All of them living there, man. All of them living there, man. You know, I mean, I mean, you know, I mean, that's how it's going down, you know. I'm not going to step off the porch too tough, you know, because I suspect that if I do, that it may go down. So I'm just keeping my distance, you know, staying in the, staying within the circumference of the circumference right now. So we're going to see what's going to happen right now. For an argument. For argument. For a decent, simple argument between siblings. There's how many cars? Eight. Um, this is hood news. News you can use. They mad because we recording. So, yeah, bucking it. Getting bucked. Collins Bay, they letting her go. Or is he tightening her cuffs? We hoping that he let her go. Can we get a beat on it? Can we get a beat? No, I can't get too close. I gotta, you know, I gotta stay within the perimeter. Hopefully, they let her go. Hood news. This is what I really mean. The excessive force and brutality when not needed, got to stop, has to stop, must stop, and, and it will stop. Come on down to Fast Break Clothing. You get the best deal in town. This is Collins Bay, hood news, news you can use. I'm here with my boy Jeff. And Jeff, when did you get this vehicle, man? First of all, man. tell us, what is this, man? For those man, who don't a, know, what is a, this in the hood, this man? This is Chevy Camaro, you know what I'm saying? You gotta definitely get that badge right there, that Z28 thing, you know what I'm saying? Okay. It's, it's definitely official. Yeah, what kind of rims are them, man? Shit, they just some black 22, okay. man, I ain't gonna lie. You That's know what I'm saying? That's what's up, man. Black 22s from Claire. Yeah, man, we in the hood. What? So, what kind of steering yeah, yeah. wheel is that right there? Definitely the wood grain, I mean. Ooh. Ain't nobody gripping, gripping grain gripping like that. Gripping grizzle. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's gripping not grain like oak. That. That's right. grizzle. Right. Mm. So there let me know. ask you this. What's I mean, up? is this just is this something you do, or are you part of a club out here? And yeah, I'm part of a car club, but this is what I do too. You know what I mean? I've been doing this for a couple of years. Okay. I mean, back to back summers. You, man, anybody that know me, they know. They so, know. So what you represent that ACO or that nah, a D town? Okay, that's yeah, what's but up. But I rep that Denver. That's what's up. All day, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, man. That's what it is. All right, man. That's what's up. I like that. Cut. This is Collins Bay. Hood news. News you can use. I'm with my boy here, Mac. Okay. And uh, Mac, tell us what is this vehicle? Man, that's that uh, that's 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 that Brody for the female. Mm -hmm. That's that Patron and Nuvo, you know what I'm saying? Okay. They don't know about it yet, it ain't finished, but it's about a hundred percent, you know what I'm saying? It'll be one ten, give me a couple weeks. Still waiting on some of the finishing touches, but it's good enough, you know what I'm saying? Okay, now tell us uh what kind of rooms is there, man? I got them twenty six inch floaters on there. You know what uh -oh. I'm saying? Floaties? I got they got us they got a float. Mm -hmm. 
Just tell them to get, just give them a little something to look at, you know what I'm saying? Louis all through that thing. That's what's up. Got the Toronto Nouveau with a little Louis. Can't forget that. That's what's up. So, so, uh, so, uh, Mac, what neighborhood you from, man? What neighborhood? Man, I'm from Denver, man. I'm a real Denver nigga. From East Denver, though. I ain't really trying to say out too much, but, you know. That's what's we up. We get to the end. That's what's up. All right, now, I mean, is this your everyday situation, or, or are nah, you part of a club? Driver, or? But, okay. yeah, we got a car club out here for everybody who don't know. Chevy Monsters. You will know. Please believe it. You know what I'm saying? We the talk of the town. It really ain't got to do no no real promotion yet, but don't even trip. You're going to see it. You can't miss it. With shit like this, you can't miss it. We got, we got whips. You know what I'm saying? How can you miss that? We also mess with a couple car clubs called uh, Fast Lane and Chevy Kings, but, you know what I'm saying, we do our own thing. They do their thing. We do our own thing, so it is separate. You know what I'm saying? It's Chevy Marshall. But it's still ride. unity, yeah, though. Yeah, it's still, yeah. Still, the okay. day we all come together okay. and ride, you know, okay. whether we put the differences aside, whatever there may be. Okay. Because there's a lot of talk going around, but, hey, we've been out here. I, I put a lot of people on with these whips. I got people riding. I don't hate on nobody. I just do my thing. This my Brody right here. We're going to keep this going. You know what I'm saying? Ain't none of this stopping. Y'all want more whips, rims, paint, whatever, beats, whatever. We got all that. So just fuck with it. So this is what I'm going to tell all the car clubs out there right now. If you want to get on Hood News, there's a number at the bottom and where you can reach us on any kind of level, political, or some bullshit. Collins Bay, Hood News, news you can use. Yes, sir.